When saving your baby's cord blood, you need to understand the different processing methods because this is how the cord blood will be prepared for storage and future use. The processing method can affect the number of stem cells available, the types of stem cells available, the size of the sample, and the number of times it can be used. Any of these factors could determine the effectiveness of cord blood for treatment, and once it's been processed, it can't be reversed, so choosing the best processing method is important. One common processing method is volume reduction that extracts hematopoietic stem cells from the cord blood. Within the cord blood is a wide variety of stem cells, hormones and growth factors, but a lot of these valuable components are lost during the volume reduction technique. Clinical trials and medical studies about using cord blood stem cells to treat many diseases are increasing rapidly, and your child might miss out on potential future medical breakthroughs using the stem cells removed in the volume reduction process. However, our latest service called Cells Plus, powered by Totisite, preserves more stem cells both pre-freeze and post-thaw than any other processing technology we tested. Totisite is a blood separation technology based on a precise dilution of DMSO and Dextran, two solutions universally used in cord blood banking and wider blood therapy arena. Approved by the Human Tissue Authority, Totisite is the highest performing cord blood processing system in the world, patented by and is exclusive to Cells for Life. Totisite delivers 100 to 400% more viable stem cells post-thaw than any other processing technology. For many transplants, the total number of cells needed is linked to the patient's body weight. As your baby grows into an adult, more stem cells will be required for transplant. Using Totisite, your baby's cord blood will be useful throughout their whole life, not just in childhood. The more cells stored, the more transplants can be done. We store the cord blood in up to six subdivisions, so if a treatment only needs part of the sample stored, we keep the remainder in storage for future therapies. And we don't know yet which cord blood stem cells are going to be the most useful in the future, which is why it's important to store as many types as possible. Most technologies lose primitive cells during processing, but Totisite retain many early stem cell types, so your child is prepared for whatever cord blood therapies arise during their lifetime.